Nordic fiction, to a certain extent, is more why done it than who done it. I really don't want it to turn into how done it. Uh, I mean that 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 really the the intrigue of the story is all about just exactly how utterly painful and 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 horrible this murder was. Uh, in fact, okay. Well, um, I think that as an author, if you want to uh, do your job well, you have to ha have a very good reason for why as to why you're doing why uh, why are you putting precisely precisely this in your book. And one of our very uh, good friends and colleagues in Denmark had her, uh, some of her books uh, um, made into movies. And the movies was just, oh, they were completely splattered with blood everywhere. And she was asked why, uh, why it was like that. And she couldn't really answer, except she said, okay, this is sort of what we feel uh, the, the audience wants now, and that's just to me that's not a good enough reason. Uh -huh. So I yeah, so I think you can absolutely make graphic violence and make it beautifully and and well and art uh, with with the aesthetically yeah. But the uh, point is to me there has to be a very good reason why you would use that specific tool. I mean, to tell your story. It's dead. Story. It's dead yeah, easy I to don't. grow someone out. All you have to do is explain exactly how it feels. And smells and 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 I mean, if you uh, um, just poke a screwdriver through someone's eyeball, and uh, yeah, I mean that's that's easy, but it's not interesting. I don't like to write uh, very detailed illustrations of violence. Like, I don't find it interesting, and I don't find it important. Also, I I rather there there is violence, but uh, I leave the reader to. To imagine it, what, what, how it happened. Actually, I don't, I don't like to give, give all the details. And also, I'm more interested to, to explore the consequences of violence. Yeah. What happens after? Mm -hmm. So the family of the victim, or or whatever.